Greetings and welcome back to Foundation. I'm Catherine of Sky and I was sitting for just a few minutes here listening to the opening track of the game and I kind of wish it was in the game at some points because it's so dramatic and lovely. I was just very much enjoying it. Anyway, we are back to um, our village and a couple of people mentioned to me that I took out the... Um, the extraction zones of the berries out of a few places we need to go get that done uh this is very yeah yeah these berries are out of the zone i kind of forgot about that sorry guys there we go take the berries have a nice time um maybe stone as well the stone here seems to be covered this is good um where else we had some more berries going on there's berries here and there's berries near here. Those are covered. All right. And these are... Those are fields. Oh, this is stone. Never mind. That has to be there as well. Okay, it looks like we've cleared out a lot of the forest, uh, which is great. And I think we also removed our iron extraction zone as well. Well then. Aha. Uh -huh, there we go. That is not great. So, um, what do we got going on here? We have this being slowly replanted. This is being replanted by these foresters. I don't know if this is going to get replanted, to be honest. I think that the foresters may have their hands full. So we'll have to watch that and see if that is applicable. Anything else that we're missing? I wonder if the apiary has to have an extraction zone or something or farm or I'm not quite sure. I mean, I suppose I could just make the whole thing an extraction zone. I'm not really sure if that matters at all. Probably not, I would guess. I do like that they have these different paths inside the monastery. That's great. Um, anyway, um, let's see. What else shall we do? I think, I think we might be good. Now, somebody mentioned about this stone bridge here. Um, let's see. Yeah, we need 693 stone. So they suggested that I did not take stone mason or stone gatherer, whatever they're called over here, stone cutters um, off of here. And I think that is a good idea. I had kind of forgotten about the bridge and about stockpiling the stone. And no wonder we weren't getting any berries. <laughs> Though I think we did this fairly recently, I hope, to uh, change the extraction zones. Anyway, um, Things are looking really good. Now, we do have the housing upgrade off right now because of the tools here. Let's go ahead and increase the speed a bit uh, and see if that gets us any better. So we have lots of iron ingots. We have no coal. Coal is the big problem now. But we are getting these forests uh, planted. Can you choose what kind of trees you want to plant? Hello, Forester. No, that's a that's a bakery. That would not be the right... Oh, gosh. I'm forgetting my hotkeys. Uh, Mashinki has this wonderful... You can press delete and all the windows will close, which is very handy. Okay, so here we have the Forester camp. There's no way to change the trees. Like, I would love to, to, to make these kinds of, like... These are oak trees, I think, and these are what? Maple? Maple. They look really tasty, crunchy, don't they? I like... Um, yeah, these are maple. Those are oak. Oh, man. Those are nice. Anyway, I wish you could change the trees that you could plant uh, with, with that. Maybe that's a thing that'll come in the future. I don't know. But it seems nice. Or maybe you could even choose, like, in here um, with the reforestation zones. That might be a nice thing to do. Anyway, um, that that uh, hopefully the developers will listen and, and think about this. This would be good. Now, we do have 100 iron ore uh, slotted in here. Somebody asked how many miners I have assigned. There are three miners assigned to the iron ore. Um, let's look at these forester camps. There's one, oh, not, not the forester camps. I mean these guys. Lumber extraction camps. Right. Three and three. That's fine. Good, good. And then we have the monastery. Yes. It is on pause. I think we should unpause it for now. I think we can get it going. There we go. Wow. Stuff is going to happen now. Now, somebody mentioned to me that the height of the tower is not relevant. So I'm thinking I would really like to just delete this entire thing, this entire building, this one. Uh, because, oh, look what we have. Oh, my God, I noticed. Oh, ho, ho. hey, thank you, devs. Woohoo! This is wonderful. Oh, we can now scroll. Look at this. Oh, thank you. Thank you, devs. 
Um, they must have been listening because now we have a scroll bar. I noticed there was an update today for Foundation, and here it is. Ha <laughs> ha, wonderful. Oh, this is so good. I'm so I'm excited. I can you tell I'm, I'm excited slightly? Anyway, um, I am excited. We can actually delete this entire thing and then put the structures attached to this one if we wanted to. So what do we what we have here? I think we have a small treasury and two big ones. Right, what I'm gonna do is probably make everybody scream just slightly because I'm going to delete this and our money is going to get deleted along with it. Probably, how much are we getting? 3,000 to the village treasury. Bye. Yep, 2,400. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, don't worry. It's it's just fine, it's fine, it's fine. Anyway, um, <laughs> we need a tax office here. I think that's what we had over there. But we need, I think I want to have a, let's slow the game down just a teeny bit. I want to have a, we could do a small treasury here actually to connect it as a connecting building. That might be fun. Yeah, yeah. Just walk among the piles of gold to get to the tax office. It's fine. There we go. I think I might put it backward one. Yeah, there we go. Tax office. Do, 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 do. Where is it? I can't see it because my brain is not working well. There we go. Oh, no. There. 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 There we go. I have a little courtyard in there as well. That's quite nice. All right. And we will add the treasuries. Uh, here it is. Do we need the bailiff office? Do we already have this thing? Oh, yeah. That's the tower thing. All right. We don't want another bailiff. We decided that we can't really get anybody useful there. This one would cost... See, 47. I kind of want to recreate the other style there. Oh, it wouldn't cost us any extra. That's nice. Okay, cool. Works for me. And then we'll have the treasury stuck off here to the side. Add 1900. It will cost 52. Treasury. See, again, it says 1900 still. It doesn't actually change. That number does not change at all. Even if I add extras. This is very strange. Um, we had two towers. I don't know how much we'll need after this, but let's just put them on the back here. Just stick them there. And see if that gives us anything. This is this looks really dumb, I have to say. It really is bad. Um, I could put... I don't know. I'm kind of torn on this. Should I put it decoratively-ish? That looks horrible. It really looks bad. I feel like hiding it in the background. Uh, oh, look what else we have here. We have these guys taking a path through here, but they don't need to because there's only the forestry huts are here. They don't need to go that way. They do not. So should be fine. I could put one inside as well. Yeah, maybe we'll do that like that. Treasury. looks very peculiar but it should be fine right this is gonna look really strange but I think it might be okay I don't know maybe I shouldn't mess with that this area at all we just click these off I think that area looks okay maybe we should just hide them behind here and then just put several of them treasury to Three, like this. <laughs> that makes it look very strange. Spiky roof over here. Um, but I want to pay the minimal amount for this and have the amounts in our treasury available. Hmm. Grumble, grumble, grump, grump. That's what I'm thinking at the moment. Oh, the devs, though, man. That is awesome. I'm so glad the devs added this scroll bar thingy. This is good. Life is now clearly better. Okay, this makes it look quite <laughs> quite scary. Very sharp and like, okay, better not mess with the tax people. All right, so this says adds 1900 to the village treasury capacity. Let's see what happens with this. Um, we will see. Let's just do this. 2400. And this is videoed, so <laughs> hopefully remember this. I love this scroll thing. That's great. All right, anyway, and you see the devs are listening. Yay, I'm so excited. They are hearing our cries of help, and they helped us, and now our village could grow better. Oh, this is so nice. Anyway, thank you, devs. Um, 
Okay, so we have a farm, and I, I don't know if it was me specifically. Other people might have noticed this, but I am happy that it got fixed. All right, we have 247 stone at the moment. We need many and much, uh, 693, but I'm going to fast forward stuff, and I think what I want to do, I really am curious about this. Is this going to add 1,900, or is it going to add more? Let's prioritize this place. What do we need for this? Only 85 planks. We have mountains. We need 110 stone, 30 tools. All right, we're short on tools, but that's getting fixed. Now, charcoal people, how are you guys doing? You guys are okay. You're lacking on wood a little bit. That's fine, but there's plenty of coal. So blacksmiths, hey, how's it going? Oh, right. We're missing iron. Right. <gasps> we're missing coal. Uh-huh. That does not sound beneficial. Is this thing... This thing is nothing. Why does this not have anything in this thing? Did this get reset somehow? Hold on. Looks like all of these markets got reset. All of the warehouses. This is not good. This is definitely not good. Alright, we have to redo our markets and stuff. Because at the moment, things are not going at all. Alright, so this has um, stone blocks. All right, I think this has... Oh, jeez Louise. Wow, I don't remember even what was here. Um, okay, let's start with the easy ones. We're going to start with the easy ones first. This one had glass in it, I think. This one had the sheep supplies, I think. So we had wool here. Wool, hello. Wool, clothing, cloth. And then the extra one was gloss. So let's just find gloss here. There it is. There, there we have that one. Okay, that's an easy one. Good, good, good. Oof, this is... I don't like... I don't know how that got reset. I, I must have been with the update. That's all I can think. Um, okay, so this was the food one. This one we had flour and wheat... And we had bread. And was there anything else? I think that might have been it. We might have had something like polished stone or something here. Last week, flour, honey, weapons, wine. Might have had fish here. This is a good place to have fish. Well, actually, this around here might be a better place to have fish. Anyway, this one is going to be the coal stuff. So this is going, to, not coal stuff, but the, the other thing imaging stuff. Yeah, coal we want. We want iron. Uh, tools. Oh, the other one had tools. That's what it was. Okay, so coal, iron. Yes. Tools and... Hmm. Did we do iron ingots? Or iron ore, maybe? Iron ore. There we go. We'll have all of these here. This one, I know that this one had tools in it. One of the slots was for tools. I think we had tools here. And we had planks. And we had stone pieces. And then fish I think because these guys needed a place to put it yeah I think that's good for that one now let's see where else do we have an issue with storage here this is going to also be the flour bread thing let's see go actually there's going to be two here because we need bread and flour and wheat and then this one has the clothing stuff because there's a sheep farm here. Oh, yeah, someone mentioned that my sheep farm is not producing the optimal amount of sheep or wool. Uh, I will check on that in a second. Uh, right, so these two have this stuff. Now then, oh, yes, and one of them can have stone and polished stone since they're right next to each other. Let's have one stone and then one polished stone. I really hope these are close to how we had them set up before. Um, yeah. So it's worth setting it all up if that means we get scroll bars. It's worth it. Okay. Um, let's see. Is I think this... Yeah, this berry must be an extraction zone because they're extracting. 
Um, let's see. What do we do next? Are you done yet? You're not done yet. Let's go. Come on, guys. Finish up this bakery. Let's look at the sheep farms. Um, this one... I don't know how to tell. There's four sheep around this farm. Okay, so they're fine. Now, here we have two sheep farms. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Wait, hold on. Pause. See, there's one, two, three, four, five. But there are more. There's some hiding in the forest. Six. Oh, dear. Four, five, six, seven, eight. This has eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, and that's the sheep. There's no more sheep farms. So I think we have the, the right amount for all of them. Which is great. I'm excited about this. All right. So now we're kind of like waiting for stuff to get done at the moment. We have several fishing shacks being made. Oh, <gasps> hey, how does, how's this going? Is this done yet? Almost done. We need more tools, but that's getting sorted. I hope. I don't know what's these. The problem with this is I have no idea what these goods are. Okay. We actually do know we have 45 iron ore and then 44 coal. So we just need more more iron i think let's see iron smelter there we go we're getting stuff barbara and grace are working here working hard do we have another iron smelter this we definitely need i think all right let's make another iron smelter out here uh right let's go iron smelter there we go and uh that's an interesting fence just to have like in the middle of nowhere i like this like no we refuse to have you wait is that the door yes it is i thought it was a window um all right it'll be fine it'll be good we'll put this right across from the blacksmith shop they should be happy i think i hope let's get that going and we'll put this also on priority after this gets done we need this done first there are nine of 24 tools we'd still have the housing authorized not uh upgrading not oh my god my brain does not work it's fine though it's fine we need glass. I don't know if we have any. Let's check our um, list of products that we have. This is the butter list. I think it's this one. There we go. Resource panel. Okay. Wow. We're very short on berries still. I kind of worry about the berries. But now we got stuff going. We have five glass in one of the stockpiles this is good news so our trade route is working i am intending only to buy five glass we can buy another five later i just don't want to change the whole thing often uh, and such so this is looking very very pretty we need this iron smelter done though come on guys come on guys let's go oh oh getting close getting close we're getting more tools happy days are here again life is getting better People are not authorized to upgrade their houses yet. Oh, look at how pretty this church is. Oh, it's lovely. Absolutely lovely. Man, oh man. Okay, we'll build another one soonish, I think. Actually, we could. This one is probably overcrowded. This one, I love this church. This reminds me verily of um, the churches in, uh, in Moscow and the Kremlin. They are very, very pretty. 60 of 60. See, they love this. Even though some people might be like, what the heck is this? It is actually quite beautiful, I think, and uh, in its own way. And um, people are coming. They love this church. Our church, great. Our church, great. Uh, so I'm wondering if it's a good thing. Here, these are also full. 40 of 40 going to this church. I wonder if it is a good idea. Oh, these are 43 of 43. I wonder if people have no faith, some of them. Yeah, 12 villagers have no place to um, say their prayers. That's rough, really rough. So I'm wondering if I should get a church or this, see this costs money. If I get a rustic church out here, and this actually makes sense to have, you know, one big sort of cathedral place, um, but also smaller, uh, which we'll call them places like um, these rustic churches, you know. All right, if we do a core B, we could put this church around here. Be safe to put it here, I think. Do we want core B or core regular core? Oh yeah, we love this regular core. So that gives us. Does it tell us twenty? 
Yeah, there we go. We need more cores. I want to have a bunch of people being able to go to this church. Can I put one in the center so that the roof goes through? No, apparently not. This can have a hundred villagers at the moment. Okay, we can have a small tower. Do these towers increase the capacity? Small tower, unnamed part. Extension C. Nope, only the cores. So it's quite important to have a good... Whoa, no, 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 no. Hello, no, no. Yeah, ah, ah. I want... Ah. No, excuse me. All right, fine. You know what thing? You're just being a pest. I really would just want to change the height of the core. That's what I wanted to do. And it's being pesty at the moment. Ah, oh, there we go. I could do this in an interesting way. It'd be like really... Like have a very funky thing. That's 80. But it doesn't give us additional capacity and it does look very... Too, too exciting, I think, <laughs> for our poor villagers. Um, however, we could put these sideways like this as well. To have almost like a meeting hall. Or we could do it almost, oh, kind of like a monastery almost. Like this. Or have a wing kind of thing going on. And we could just have a whole bunch of people coming through here. Or like a modern kind of a thing. I know I, I went to a church that had sort of a like a little courtyard where people could meet and gather and they had like meeting halls and whatever. How many people? We've got 120 people can come to this church. We have um, they're lacking 18. But you know some of these people could come here. Some could go to the other place as well. So now we can decorate this place. Like this, and have nice little doors coming on. I have to confess, I really enjoy, like, making these things. <laughs> I love them. They're so much fun. Okay, we'll have one going there as well. A door. And then maybe a door out the side. This side. To come in from that side. All right, and then we have towers. Oh, we want to do this dark theme as well. I don't like the light theme at all. It is pretty much awful. And this is nice that it costs none. This is good. Want to move that inside? No, I think it's fine on that side there. Um, small tower, that's this one. Hmm... No, I'm kind of liking that tower as it is. Extension C. Okay, that's all right. Extension B is this one. Oh, it's another tower. Could make this a tower in the middle. Like out here. Or at the back of this area. And then make this spire a little bit taller. That's quite a nice little church, I think. I like it very much. Uh, and this will have capacity of 120. That's really good. Give us some 11.5 splendor. It's very expensive, but maintenance cost of zero. So, you know, it's really not, uh, not, not something we're going to have to worry about terribly. And it is very nicely close to the monastery. Let's see. How do we want to put this? I guess we can put it even put it this way or a little bit apart so that we have a room for the garden inside i'm not gonna have people settle inside that seems very silly but this is close enough to the monastery though i suppose the only thing that is wrong here is that everything do we have anything on the right these two are almost on the right axis um because as i recall churches are supposed to face a particular direction uh, i think it's east uh, but I don't remember exactly. So we could actually move this 
to be in alignment with these other buildings. Ish. And who knows which way they have the altar in there, so that's that's not our concern. They can organize the altar any way they want. Let's put it here. Let's just make sure our monastery... This is our central building, so it's going to go the, be this way. Um, we are not going to build outward, so that's okay over there. Okay, even though this is not exactly... I think it's fine. I think this layout is actually quite fine. We can put some bushes around the entrance here. Yep. I think that's nice. Let's put it there. I think that looks really nice. We could even have more houses coming in here a little bit. Or a garden, perhaps, between this uh, church and the monastery. Do we want to add anything else to this? There's an unnamed part. Um, it should be called another tower or something. Uh, extension B, C. Those are nice, but they really are not. I mean, I guess I could stick it on this side or something. I don't know. Though it doesn't really add anything specific. It just makes that side less boring. I wonder if I should add a door on that side. Nah, it's fine. They can come from the front. Okay, I think I like this actually very much. Um, gonna go with the dark theme. I like the dark theme. This light theme, you almost can't see this thing. It's very, very light and it's like disappears. But this, it's like, yes, nice. Um, this works for me. Right. Okay, so, um, yeah, let's start the construction on this then. There we go. Boom. I want to pause this, though. I really would like to get the monastery up and running better. How's this going? Are we good? Oh, we are. Oh, hello. All right, so that thing that it said adds 1900. That must have been the original thing. And now we have 5,100 in the thing. I don't remember if what we had it at before or if someone can do the calculations on how much each treasury adds. I think it's supposed to be 1,500 per each of these little buildings, uh, but I don't know. I might go back and do the calculations myself. I, I just simply don't remember the numbers at the moment. But anyway, uh, let's get this one to be made... Ooh, wait, hold on. We need these guys made next. Don't pause. Why, why are these paused? That's... I remember pausing them now. I'm like, wow, I'm never going to remember their pause. And you know what? I didn't. I had to actually look at them. I was like, hmm, these are not getting constructed. Uh, all right, so we got that going. We have these happening. We've got bread being made. Shirts. Wow, we're out of t-shirts. Oh, we're not having our t-shirts made fast enough. Why is that? Are we short on stuff? cloth to t-shirts this is we have two tailors we i think we intended to have two tailors you guys are short on sheep did we not have another sheep farm oh there are two sheep farms here oh <gasps> that's the sheep farm that's missing a sheep or all the sheep it has no sheep right it wasn't just missing one sheep it was missing four. Oh dear all right, uh, we got it fixed now. <laughs> so hopefully this should be enough to supply us with t-shirts for a while. Yes, I hope. How, how many people does this have? 40 people. So yeah, you could do like tiny little churches as well. I really like, I love this church. If I could blueprint this church, I totally would. This is just beautiful. It is my favorite church. If you can, can you actually blueprint this church? Huh, edit? I guess not. I guess you could add different pieces of different um, colors to this, maybe. I'm not sure what would happen if you edited it, changed it, and then added the light color. Would it add new stuff in the light color or add, make the whole thing light color? I imagine it would make the whole thing light color, but man, is this pretty. I love this. Anyway, sorry. Um, I am dwelling much on the prettiness of the game. But here we have tax collector. Are we going to... We do have our tax collector. Let's see. Name a bailiff. All right. These are job learning speed. I don't care about that so much. Um, I'm not that interested in soldiers. I don't know why we need a soldier, to be honest. Uh, we haven't been attacked yet. We are supposed to build a wooden keep. And I, I have to admit, I have been um, putting this off for a while. Mostly because of the economy. 
but also because I really don't want to be attacked. <laughs> I really don't. <laughs> it's like, no, 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 thank you. Now, how did this happen? Why are some roofs blue and some brown? Is this the way I did it somehow? In the way that I did the coloring? Maybe I did the coloring and then add change the pieces around? This is most curious to me. I will find out what, what happened here. This is interesting. All right. Anyway, we have a little gate into the monastery. Come on, guys. Come on. Make stuff, please. All right. We're looking probably for tools. We have mountains of tools. Why are these people not doing stuff? You're looking to fill your needs. Follow villager. You are assigned to be a miller and a builder at once. Let's check on mail 376. You seem to be okay. Why are these people assigned to weird jobs? I don't get this. On a transport mandate. Okay, that sounds useful. Hmm. I worry about this sometimes. All right, let's check our job list again because we may have issues again. Okay, let's look at it again. Um, bailiff office. We don't need that one at the moment. Fisher's hut. Yes, please. Let's have one here. Oh, we have too many work. We have too many builders, I think. Let's sort by job. Builders. Whoa, whoa too many builders. All right. Mail. You're not going to be a builder anymore. Okay. You. Wow. Interesting. A lot of these people are just not doing well. They are confused. Gathering hut. Yes. Iron mine. We don't need iron smelter. Yes, please. We need another builder for there. Okay. So go add this person here. Okay, luxury markets, we don't need to fill out yet, but soon. We need them soon. Small treasury, not necessary. Stonecutter camp and stonemason hut. Yeah, we're going to need a couple people for this. One. And two. Oops, that's not the one I wanted to do. Go away. Uh, I wanted to do the other one. Whoops, it's fine. Lots of treasuries that don't have workers. I don't think we need to add workers. It's not necessary. We need one, two for warehouses, though. So those people, those builders, might have actually been... Oh, this one is actually building. I'm going to leave him alone. <laughs> yep. This female is not happy. Add her here, maybe. This male, okay, unhappy again. Warehouse. I feel like these people are probably like banging their head against the wall or something. They're just like, I don't know what to do. Oh, this guy's building. All right. Gotta leave him alone. Looking to fill your needs. All right. We don't want you to fill your needs. We want you to work. <laughs> yes, it's fine. All right. So I think we have people organized at this stage at the moment. We'll add some more when we get another fisherman. Oh, we do have a fisherman there. Good. And this, hopefully, will start to get done. All right, we got males bringing stuff. And life is okay. What do we actually have on our people list? We. Job. Builder. We still have a significant number of builders. So we should be getting some of them. And we are getting some polished stone out here, which is nice. How much do we have? We have 11, so we don't have enough left, but we're getting there. So anyway, our village is looking wonderful. I'm really proud of uh, what we've done here. Everybody is happy. We have bread. We don't have many t-shirts, but we have planks. <laughs> Anyway, the people are not dying, so life is okay. Anyway, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.